Hey guys, it's Lizzie, and welcome back to being quarantined, because that's what we're all going through right now. I got a switch. It's not a special edition, it's just the generic one, because that is all I can find. Because for some reason, the switch is, like, impossible to find. Like, I'm pretty sure it's because we're all quarantined and people are bored, so everybody's buying one. But I finally got one from Best Buy. It took a while. And I also got Animal Crossing, because gonna play it with someone who I really like so um yeah <laughs> I'm gonna watch the animals cross I got the one from Target too so I got this journal with it <sighs> very much enjoy also I have a sunburn it's not as bad also this was my this is my blanket I'm wearing a blanket it doesn't look as bad as it did yesterday but you can definitely see my leg looking like a strawberry oh look at all my unshaven hair I am disgusting my arms are pretty badly burnt, too. These scars are from my dog. <sighs> so I'm in a lot of pain. You know how hard it is to find aloe vera? My dad had to go to, like, five places to find this little bottle. People are buying it all to make hand sanitizer. What has this world become? So, yeah, Lizzie finally has her Switch. If any of the Lizzie boys want to play the Switch with me... Go to my Instagram, link in the description, where I will be posting my code so you guys can befriend me. I have not unboxed everything yet, but I think I'm going to get to that. I have to plug it in first, though, so I don't feel like I'll be able to record that part. So yeah, this is going to be something. It's only 2 p.m., but I'm using artificial light because I don't feel like facing the sun right now. So we're gonna put my Animal Crossing thing here and the game here. You know, these, the size of these things is ridiculous because the actual game is just this little tiny cartridge. Most of you probably already have Switches so you know, but I can't open it. Here we have my Switch screen with the fan spinning in the background because the fan is in all of my videos, just about. One of the things. Two of the things. Why is my phone here? Also, if any of you guys like Pokemon, please tell me if it's some um, sword or shield that has Alistair in it, because that's the game I want to get. I really hope my sunburn is better tomorrow and I can, like, go outside and wear clothing. I've been wearing pajamas all day. Um, so I can actually get a carrying case for this, because I don't think I can just reuse this bag. I'd be lazy, and also I'd have nowhere to put my games. This is so messy. Where's that charging cord? It's right here. I'm an idiot. Folks, it do be charging though. It's a very long cord. <laughs> oh my god, it made a noise! Oh my god, it's making a lot of noise! Oh, that's cool. Sunday check. Um, yeah, I kind of accidentally left this video abandoned for almost an entire week, but I've decided to finish it because I wanted to upload today and I had this video being made. If you don't mind, I'm gonna go back and watch so I know what I was talking about before. Is it just me or do all of the clips in this video have a really annoying buzzing noise in the background? Um, sorry about that. If that's happened in my other videos, I, I am so sorry. <laughs> Hopefully it's just like my uploading app because like I watched the video I posted a few days ago and it wasn't like that. Um, oh my god, this background is like so pretty. Especially with Jackie Laura in it. This doll's like an unofficial icon for me. I kind of love her. So some questions that I know I'll get in the comments, like how is Animal Crossing? It's a lot of fun. And I'm pretty sure almost everyone who has a Switch or likes Animal Crossing and has a Switch, that's like the same group of people, um, has played it by now. But it is so much fun. And basically what you do in the game is you just kind of vibe. Catch some fish and then sit on a tree stump. It's... It's amazing. You're just... <laughs> I didn't mean to do that. Is someone screaming? Um, you're just vibing. The game is literally just a massive vibe. You just don't stop vibing. It's everything. Um, also, I'm not going to be sharing my friend code because... I like to open my gates for my, like... Like, my friends' friends. Like, the people I actually know. <laughs> Not that I don't consider my fans to be good people, but, you know, I just don't know y'all all personally, and 
my island fruit is peaches, so if any of y'all don't have peaches as your fruit, because literally all of my friends who have Animal Crossing, that's like five people, they all got peaches. <laughs> oranges. They all got oranges as their fruit. So I take my peaches to their islands to sell it. It's a lot of fun. <laughs> I'm getting rich. Capitalism. But yeah, I don't want to share my friend code because I just don't want to open my gates for one of my friends to come over and have like a million people show up. Obviously that wouldn't happen. I don't have that many fans, but it's just like a fear in the back of my mind. I don't want like 10 people showing up. And I know about the best friends thing, but I don't know. I just also don't think I need 100 friends on my device. If I change my mind, I'll update you all and I'll put like my Switch code in my Instagram bio or something. Not my bio, um, like a highlight? Yeah, I could do that. Yeah, I could do that. Because, you know, quarantine's boring. But I always like to call someone while I play with them and... I don't call people I don't know very well. So, yeah. That's another reason. So now we can move on with this video because I've answered the questions. There's probably going to be more questions I forgot to answer. Ask me whatever you want in the comments. If I respond, I respond. Go wild. I'm not showing my face. I don't want my face associated with this channel. Welcome back to the doll room. I'm sure you've all missed it in here. So, not much has changed. Still a mess in here. And I'm still probably going to get like 30 comments saying, Oh my god, can I clean your doll room? No. I live in organized chaos. Anyway, this is one of my recent flea market finds. It is... Obviously, it is the sweet 1600 Frankie. She has the key. It's falling. This is the original release. That's why I bought it. Because as you guys know, I do have the reissue of Claudine. And honestly, there's nothing wrong with her. She just didn't have the key or the dress she got for Draculaura. But luckily, Frankie was the only person who got Draculaura a good dress. Have you guys seen the mess that Claudine and I think Claude got for her? Like the dress that was right there when... The dolls came out like it was just terrible. So for once, Frankie pulled through. Good job, Frankie. Good fashion. Speaking of Frankie, I also have this one. I actually posted a poll asking if I should get her and like 20 of y'all said no. Who are you people? Her eyes are a little uneven, but like, whatever. Not a big deal. I kind of want to keep her in the box anyway because I don't think I have any freaky fusion dolls in the box unless i do i really need to sort all this out i need a place to put all of y'all mm, miss shadow shadow's an aquarius she is the first official omg aquarius so um we won folks i don't know why i throw this hand sign all the time at least i'm not constantly throwing peace signs that'd be even worse okay if i was a oh coffiness Okay. So I could open her if I wanted to. If I run out of videos to make. Not gonna lie. Probably will. So yesterday I was on Merc Mercari. I'm finally saying it right, folks. And actually it might have been two days ago, but I feel like it was yesterday. Point is, someone had Dead Fast Ghoulia posted. New in box. I already have her. That's why I'm saying this. And, um... It started out at 150 and I was like, huh, that's a good deal. And within like an hour, the price had gone up to $500. And I was like, wow, okay. Because, you know, wow. And it wasn't a bid. Merc Mercari doesn't have a bidding function. You just buy the item at the price it's set at. Or you can make like an offer. Point is, the doll was unsold and at $500. But then I checked it again today. And apparently that person is not a total crackhead and they were actually just reserving the item for someone. Which is... That's actually kind of wholesome. As you can tell, this video is not about my Switch very much. You got to watch me unbox it. That was it. Did I mention my severe sunburn in that video? Because... Like, in that video. Earlier in this video. Because I don't remember doing so. Because on Monday, that was when I was so burnt that it hurt to move. <laughs> Like, I woke up, fell to my knees, crawled to the bathroom, and then I just kind of laid there with violent shakes because apparently I had something called sun poisoning. And at this point, my skin is just very ashy and peeling. It looks disgusting. <laughs> Actually, it looked a lot worse when I was peeling more, but I've been using the flesh rock to get rid of my dead skin. 
Don't ask about this chunky nail. Um, I bought a new nail polish and it didn't occur to me that it was more of a top coat than like a coat coat. I don't have anyone to impress, so I don't bother with my nails during the quarantine. I hate her hair. I am going to- Like from here it's okay, but then you turn her and it's like this floppy mess. Like I'm sorry for the drag racer fans who follow me, watch my videos, but if I had to pick out of all of the OMG dolls, Miss Mediocre included, Drag Racer's the ugliest. That's not even her name. The speedster. Now that's not to insult anyone who likes her because I actually know a really good photographer on Instagram whose username is Drag Racer. Like without the E and there's like a dot in there somewhere, but like, Ugh, it's not even that impressive. But like, they're cool. It's just I don't like the character Drag Racer. D speedster! Oh my god, downtown, I didn't mean to hit you. We're gonna try to hit Speedster again. Okay, um, there we go, first try. Speaking of OMG dolls, right? So, you know how MGA is like borderline racist and always poorly distributes the doll who is, of course, black? I have seen so much of angles at Walmart. I'm so glad that they're finally correcting that because everyone deserves her. But I've also noticed that there is a lot of Miss Mediocre there. And like, it makes me think, is Miss Mediocre the most unpopular of her line? Cause like, B and DJ both sold out so fast. We all know the hell people went through to get DJ. It's me, I'm people. And um, well, none of that struggle was there when it came to getting angles or independent. Angles. Sadly, some people don't like her, but I wouldn't say that she's the most unpopular. I don't think she's unpopular. If anything, I think the most unpopular from the Lights line is most likely Dazzles. She's gotten a lot- Dazzle. She's gotten a lot of hate. I don't know. I kind of want to make, like, a popularity poll for each, like, wave to see who the most popular from each wave is. But I 100% would get a bunch of answers from people who are confused and just like slapping in their favorite overall. Like, no, I am trying to get the favorites from each specific line. So for instance, wave one would be Swag, Neo, Lady, and B. Like that's wave one. And then there would be Winter Disco, all that, you know? I guess I could group um, Up and Downtown with um, Shadow for the rest of wave two? I don't know. I've just been thinking about that. I think it'd be fun. I just have shadow brain rot right now. She is my favorite doll. Anyway, I've let this video go on for far too long. Please ignore how awful my Dazzle's eyes are painted on. But um, thank you all so much for watching this video and I hope to see you in my next one. I'm not sure if I'll be able to post this much, so much this week because I have a lot of online school. Bye.